na tuwataka pia tuje hapa siku ya leo kando na kusema pole kwenu kuambia yule IG wa polisi bwana Kome akome tabia mbaya Kome afanye nini Kome afanye nini Tuambia bwana Kome akome sababu hawa walio mbele zetu ni watu these are not statistics these are not hired coffins or hired bodies these are Kenyans who have been killed by police bullets na leo pia tumekuja hapa kusema haya mambo sio mambo ya wajaluo kule western tumezika watu Tulianza na kuzika kijana mmoja anaitwa Edward Wanjala kule Transoya. Bwana Wajakoya na ndugu yetu Oparanya wamemzika Mesha Shireka kule Kakamega. Kule Busia tumemzika kijana Duncan Wanyama. Na hapa Vihiga juzi tumemzika boxer alikuwa boxing anaheshimika sana anaitwa Rafael Shigali. Kesho tukitoka hapa tuenda Luanda kuzika vijana wawili Brian Onyango na William Amulele Hawa vijana walikuwa hapa Nyalenda walivamiwa kwa nyumba yao ulikuwa usiku wa manane hakukuwa na maandamano ya usiku na tujawahi fanya maandamano ya usiku kama wanaazimio wakatolewa kwa nyumba zao wakapigwa wakawawa na polisi Leo tuko Nyanza kuomboleza nanyi kesho tuko Western kuomboleza na nyumba ya Mlembe. Na leo kama huyu inspector Kome hajakoma haya maneno wabunge wetu wamesema hapa twataka tukitoka hapa tuanze ile process ya kumngoa mamlakani Kome akome kwa IG wa Police of the Republic of Kenya. Hayo ndio tutafanya tukitoka hapa. Na kama hivi is in doubt, tukija hapa nimepata bad news. Ndugu yangu Steven Kalonzo Msioka amenionyesha ya kwamba tuna pasta aliyepigwa risasi kule Kitengela Pastor Peter Wanyama alipigwa risasi tarehe mbili na ameishi na hiyo risasi hadi akapoteza maisha yake. So that is another one ambaye anatoka kule magharibi ameongezeka sababu ya risasi ya bwana Kome na polisi wake. So leo ni kusema pole lakini mniruhusu kwa kimombo kidogo sababu we want the world to know that we are here in Bondo today to mourn victims of police brutality. And as we mourn we are not just here to mourn with the families We are here to assure the families all families whose families have been affected as victims of police brutality that as a zimio we will stand with you in the quest for justice nationally and internationally we will stand with you unto the ends of the earth until justice is done we will never rest na ndio sababu we are saying here today as azimio we have objected to the presence of the prosecutor of the international court criminal court ICC bwana Khan he has come to Kenya at a time of gross violation of human rights as a prosecutor he has come to wine and dine with those who have been suspects at the ICC and who are future suspects because of the atrocities we are seeing before us today and he has not just wined and dined with them he has been wining and dining and riding in their helicopters